Prophetic Word for Denmark, August, September 2023. Hi, my name is Bettina Enemark and I'm from Denmark. I have a prophetic word for the Christian in Denmark. I see in a vision Jesus standing in front of the person and he breathed new life into the death and abundant brain. I hear the Spirit of God saying, I come and renew your mind and mindset, Denmark, so that you can see and discern what is the kingdom of God, that which is true and noble, just, and gives a clean conscience, that which is esteemed and spoken well of, yeah, all that exceeds and is worthy of praise. I give you the opportunity to get close to me so that you can be equipped and raised up to be able to distinguish in the spirit between whether you serve me and my kingdom or you serve yourself, the spirit of the world or the kingdom of the darkness. But I have that against you, Denmark, that you are in rebellion against me and my DNA for life, the family, the roots, the Jewish roots, and the ecclesia in my kingdom. It is time now that you repent of your pride and rebellion against me. Humble yourself, ask for forgiveness, and let the blood of Jesus cleanse you. Seek my word and the principle of my kingdom to follow and become a disciple of my son, Jesus Christ. I will teach you my ways, heal you and deliver you. When you see yourself in my light, you also see what lives in you and you can choose to bow your knees to me and seek my wisdom, insight, love and the fear of God. Or you can choose to hide from me run away and seek out other man-made gods who satisfy your soul, your wishes, and your desire for a time. But hereby you will not experience my freedom, nor be in my kingdom. I am here, and I am the almighty God and King. I am full of love, and I wish you success in your life and with your family. I managed to do much more for you than you or anyone else can do. I am your greatest encourager, your redeemer, your creator, your father, your provider. Yes, I am all that you need every day. Let everything you think and do be laid before me and my throne and enter my gates with thanksgiving. Immerse yourself in my word and talk to me daily about your life and your walk. I want a close relationship with you so that you know me and you can choose to follow me and my ways. But I am the Holy One and I do not share my glory with anyone. I will give you power, strength and insight through my Holy Spirit when you search me with all of your hearts so that you can think my thoughts and understand the spread of my kingdom. I want to heal you and deliver you from the power of darkness. Thereby you can choose whether you want to serve me or go your own way. But I say to you, Denmark, decide today who you want to serve, yourself, the power of darkness, or me, the living, almighty, and only God. The choice is yours. Denmark, you must take the lead in the reconciliation of the Kingdom of Denmark. Greenland, Faroe Island and Denmark must be one in me and you must together honor your Jewish roots. I want unity among you, so humble yourself, seek my forgiveness and lift up your siblings. Intercede for your friends. He who wants to be the greatest among you must be the servant of all. Let me hear your godly heart breathe and prayers of repentance. Then I will close the gates 
to foreign gods that flow freely across your borders and which you lead my people to worship. I release innovative thoughts and creativity beyond my people. If you want it, you must come to me so that I can teach you my ways to go and I will let you build a part of my kingdom as in heaven it should be on earth in you and around you. I want you to seek me and ask me for solutions to the challenge you see and in honest surrender to me you will get vision and in ideas piece by piece to solve the ch challenges that my people and the kingdom of Denmark are facing. I'm a holy God, and I do not share my glory with anyone. Give me all the glory, and you will see that I'm sending you to be and make a difference and build my kingdom in, in this time you live in. And kingdom of Denmark, come to me in worship and prayer. Ask me for wisdom, humility, and true fear of God. Then I will give you power and strength to search for me. I will teach you to love, to read and understand my word, understand the principle of my kingdom and be led by the, my Holy Spirit. I will teach you to distinguish between thoughts from me, yourself and from the power of darkness. I will make you my spiritual warrior they hear my voice and do what I say. I will teach you to renounce the thoughts and spiritual manifestation of darkness. The battle is not between flesh and blood, but against authorities and spiritual power in heaven. I will teach you to stand up against the things that have taken you by surprise, but from which I can deliver you when you choose me as your first priority, I'm waiting for you. Loving greetings from your Father, creator of heaven and earth and all life.